Hi, this is Richard Byrne at freetechforteachers.com. In this video, I want to show you how you can create a simple Thanksgiving card by using Storyboard That. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm already signed into my account, and I'll click Create a Storyboard. And for the purposes of demonstration, I'm only going to create one frame in this story. The process is the same throughout, throughout all the frames that you create, but I'm going to choose a setting for my story. By default, you'll have the town scenes, but I'm going to go into the outdoors. And I'm going to have my Thanksgiving feast set outdoors. And there's my background, and I'm just going to drag that into place. All right. Now let's go ahead and look at characters. And if there's a character I like from the 1600s to 1950s, I can drag that character in. There we go drag that character into place. If I click the, click on that character, I can modify how that character appears. Change the hair and the skin color and give the character some eyes. And now I want to put a table out here for my Thanksgiving feast. So I'll do a quick search for table. That'll pull up all kinds of clip art that I can use. Let's just drag that into place. And now I want to have my character welcome you to the first Thanksgiving feast. So I want to do a quick search for Thanksgiving. And I know that will bring up a picture of a turkey and some other food. So let's go ahead and drag that turkey onto the table. And he's going to welcome you by using some textables. I'm going to drag in and say, Welcome to Thanksgiving dinner. And I can adjust my font size by choosing from the menu. All right, so for now, I'm going to move on to the next step. And I'm going to save this product. And we'll call it Thanksgiving card. And let's save it. And now on the next scene, when this is saved, we'll have the option to turn this into an actual card. Again, for the purpose of demonstration, I only used one of the three frames I have available to me. Let's go ahead and click Make a Thanksgiving card. and you can pick any one of these five borders around your card. Let's go ahead and use this one here. And that'll create for you a PDF with lines for cutting and folding the card appropriately. As you can see here, I have my two blank frames because I didn't fill them in, uh, but otherwise if you filled them in, you'd have four frames for your story. And again, with lines for cutting and folding appropriately, I can save this to my Google Drive, or I can go ahead and change that and send it to one of the printers connected to my computer. So that's how you can create a simple Thanksgiving card by using Storyboard That. For more tips and tricks like this, check out freetechforteachers.com.